Hello, this is composer of French Hornets, Richard Burdick. Today I'm showing off the oh, mutes that I got. Three different sounds. <laughs> Plywood, cedar, <laughs> the pine. <laughs> I like all three of them. I make mutes with three different types of wood. There's the cedar, which is very pretty. Um, a plywood, which is probably a flooring. Um, which is, I think it makes it brighter, and, and probably the best, even though the prettiest is not this, a um, knotty pine, low-grade knotty pine, which is the lightest also, and lightweight is good. So here's a cedar mute. This is BT5 number 21. Here is the pine, stained and lacquered sloppily, BT5 number 20. And here is a plywood. You can see the patterns here. It's strongest, uh, BT5 number 9. This one has a string with the the adjustable string length tool. You tune it by pulling the slide, this, pull that out, and you adjust the length of this piece of plastic, um, or change it, depending on the tuning needs. Um, so that's a very simple, this is poor Richard's tuning system. I think there's a big difference in the sound. So this is the important part of the video. We're gonna do this. <laughs> So that's my open horn. Here's the cedar. Here is the pine. Big difference in sound. And here is the plywood. So there you go. About 10 inches tall. I could grab it well with my hand. Some have strings, some don't. A string can be added. Pretty good at getting it to stick into the bell now. So I, I pushed it in, twisted a little bit, and these mutes stick in the bell. Thanks for watching.